Hello, this is Greg Valoria from the Nerd Soccer Media Network, and today we're talking about the California Drone Speed Challenge. Do you ever wonder what drone racing is all about? Is it a nerd sport, or is it a mainstream sport? Currently, it's probably a nerd sport, but it's quickly becoming mainstream, just as quick as this. We're here uh, with the California Drone Speed Challenge, and we partnered with the Aerial Sports League to really bring uh, bring to life this, this new exciting sport of drone racing. And so for us, it's really all about speed. And so we're celebrating speed today and hopefully we'll set a speed record on this course. Um, and in conjunction, we've introduced uh, Xfinity Gigabit Internet to the Bay Area. The key is to map the environment before you fly. Like, you know, walk around, you know where the trees are, you know where you're sitting. Because it's a cr crazy thing. When you take off, you fly around, you're looking at yourself. Like, you, you fly around, you're like, you see yourself sitting in a chair. It feels like it's like out of body experience. And um, it, it's really fun. The sport seems very inclusive, but needs an organizing body to support it. Well, six years ago, I would get together on Friday nights with friends and smash our creations together robots and other art and projects that we built. And drones became popular or available about that time. And so we immediately started fighting drones. But the commercial drones that were available would immediately break. They weren't designed for this. So my friends and I, we started a Kickstarter. And not only did we raise the money to build an indestructible drone, but we got so much attention for the world of drone combat and drone sports that it really helped us kickstart the idea that there's a global community that wants this. And from that point forward, we just didn't look back. We saw drone sports as our future. So the feel of a drone race is part tech event, part maker event, and part NASCAR race. Let's take you through a run. And why does it feel like a SF Tech event? Because of the giving back nature of the ecosystem. Well, we're eternally grateful for Comcast's partnership and their loyalty to the cause. Uh, we worked very cohesively over this past year. Um, they've involved a lot of their crews and resources to make sure that uh, women's voices are amplified. We're grateful to Comcast Xfinity, Aerial Sports League, and Girls in Tech for allowing us to report on this event. This is Greg Valoria, aka Social Greg, on Twitter for the Nerd Soccer Media Network, where we believe in tech, startup, designs, agile, and you. If you like this video, give it a like. If you want to see more, subscribe to us. Thanks for viewing, and be careful out there. <laughs>